Tony Hell for all you YouTubers that are looking for an alternative to uh, a small fishing boat cover or beamy top. This is what I've come up with. I've used two Tony Little Gazelle uh, gym sets, took the arms and the legs off of them, left one foot on each leg. This was two sets, left a foot on each leg, cut the ends off, welded them back together, which gives you enough clay to get cross members like this. Then simply by drilling holes at pre-designated sections, and taking pins out in the top here, You can free float this up or down, whatever height you want. St standing height. And you just line up the new pin holes here. If you have a standing height, put your pins back in. If you want a sitting height, there's your sitting height there. Put your pins in any, any of these positions here. Lots of room when you're sitting, depending on what you're using for a canopy. But what I did, one uh, on top of it, is I wanted the canopy to be able to move freely forward and backwards. So for example, if I want more shade out front, I can move my canopy out front if I want more shade out back. I can move it out back like that. And then by using these pinholes here, which I've pinned on both sides, I just use a, either a, a, a pin to hold it in or a nut with a wing nut on the end. But you can take it off. And the way to achieve this part is that when I joined the legs, I ran a pole on the inside and then a larger pole on the outside of that with these little pieces welded onto it so that as the legs are going open or closed these will actually rotate to allow the canopy uh, to be adjusted to whatever size you want it's a little stiff right now because it was just painted but it's another idea if you want something for more of a fishing boat, uh, more of a uh, just a pure fishing boat that gives you shelter, gives you cover. You can vel put Velcro off the end of your canopy here when you have it on and run it to the front, run it to the back, or run it down the sides here. But it's uh, just versatile. If uh, really bad weather, you can bring the canopy right down close. If it's nice warm weather, There's all sorts of adjustments you can make or choose on your on your own and then drill it wherever you want it drilled uh, to, to hold those adjustments you want to remember. Uh, the other thing you can do with this is on the top part of the canopy here, this last part of it, I left uh, a nut and a wing nut in here that can be taken off so that this piece comes right off and this, the rest of the canopy comes out of these poles can be laid down in the bottom and this whole section here folds right over down flat on the front if you're driving long distance and you don't want to have it up. This just sits down in the front of the boat and this and this will move inside of each other and come apart. But I won't demo it because uh, it takes a lot of uh, nuts and bolts to take out and she's a bit stiff right now. Just an idea. I hope you enjoyed it. I've watched the one other ones there on uh, YouTube, which gave me the idea about having something just a little bit more versatile and more permanent. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you find it useful. Again, these are Tony Little uh, Jim Gazelles. These are the, the, the leg part, the rotating part, and the handles that you would hang on to when you're going like this. 
and by cutting, just a, a foot off each one, and then welding them together, it gives you a perfect cross member for going up and down like this. Hope this is helpful. I hope you can understand what I'm talking about. Good fishing. Have fun.